Yeah, it looks good to me. <laughs> oh my god. I have to like rearrange everything. It's so much room. There's so much room. Like, not. I was gonna do a summer haul. Yeah, I was gonna do a summer haul. I was gonna do a summer haul. I literally. I'd be the one. So as y'all saw briefly, we packed the moving van last night and that had all of our furniture in it, but here's some stuff that's going in the Suburban today just to make sure we're bringing as much as possible. great omen to the beginning of the move-in vlog because one, I'm sweaty, two, I'm late, and number three, I just filmed the entire clip of me packing the car and I didn't press record. So mm, let's hope I remember for the rest of the trip. That would be not fun otherwise. So this is the Pack Suburban and in here I just have like some extra stuff that I didn't really have to pack. I just kind of pulled from last year or it was in the loft. And then in here I just have my two lampshades, my lamp, my tower and the plexiglass around my desk. And then I also have in this purse, I have like, the keys. In this purse, I have some cleaning supplies and tools. And over there, I have more cleaning supplies. In here, I just have my checklist. I think I got it all, so check on that. Hi guys. Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. If y'all are new here, my name is Megan and I'm a rising second year at the University of Virginia and today I'm moving into my first ever apartment. I'm so excited. I'm living with my best friend Lauren from high school, my roommate from last year, Emma, and Lauren's roommate from last year, Chesley. So it's gonna be super fun. Today's actually day one of move-in, so today's Tuesday. Last night we packed up the U-Haul or budget truck, whatever. We put all our furniture in there because our apartment is unfurnished, so that requires a lot of like planning and coordination. I am driving up our Suburban today, which is like the biggest car ever, which I love, just with a bunch of random stuff that I didn't really have to pack. It was either stuff from last year in the bins or stuff in the lofts that I've been keeping there. So I didn't really have to pack per se. I really just kind of carried it out to the car this morning. But all my clothes and stuff like that is going to be coming in on Saturday, which I am going up without my parents today. It's just gonna be me. We're gonna get the movers and they're gonna unpack and just put all this furniture where it needs to be. And then on Saturday, we are going to kind of put the furniture together. My dad has to attach my headboard for me, thank you, and build my dressers. I'm also going to be bringing my clothes then, and we're also going to be bringing two cars then because I get to have car this year. So it's really kind of hectic, but that's kind of what moving's like. If you guys are new, subscribe. I love college videos. This is my all-time favorite video to watch, I swear. So I'm so excited to be making one. Anyways, I hope that you guys enjoy, and let's go to Charlottesville. Okay, actually, Realty, let's go to Starbucks. So open, so much space. Kitchen looks nice and slightly messy, but there's not a lot in here. Where our little breakfast nook is gonna be. And then we're gonna have our lovely free piece of art <laughs> that perfectly matches. This is my room with lovely mirrors. My bed's gonna go here, and then dresser and desk are gonna go over here somewhere. Then I left my closet door open because I was measuring. And then I have this like elf closet down here. I don't, I think I'm gonna put my shoes in there. And then the bathroom looks like that. This, and then I have tons of space on either side, and then space back here for my laundry bin. chair didn't fit. I'm emo. What? <laughs> I'm speaking to the vlog. <laughs> but we're still keeping the ottoman because why not? What an are so ottoman. <laughs> the movers just left. They were so quick, so amazing, so highly recommend. This is our little breakfast nook and we have our table we need to set up um, and our chairs and then we have this cute little thing that's going to hold all of our appliances because the space in our kitchen is actually pretty limited. We have the gray couch here. We need to put the legs on it, the cushions, the pillows, all that and then we need to set up the TV but this is kind of just stuff out here. I got a ton of stuff in my bathroom just because some of this, this is going underneath my sink. This is like my little tower, my little cart, 
laundry basket, bathroomy stuff. And then my room is just a complete mess. Oh, and then we actually are doing this little cubicle thing in the laundry room just so that we all can have some space for whatever storage we need. And then this is gonna be a little linen closet up here. Oh yes. This looks nice. Oh yeah. And the white coffee table. Oh yeah. Ooh. <laughs> In the size. Of the <laughs> so gonna... satisfying. What? Oh yeah. Oh, it's not even. Okay, what do you think? Love it. Super cute. Look. Okay, so we kept the ottoman over here. Mm-hmm. And then those two pillows Honestly, I had in. That chair would be really big in here, like. Okay, yeah, that's cute. Then we're gonna put the lamp here, do that, maybe do another. Oh, do you like that? Oh yeah, that looks and great. It turns off. Can you touch it? Oh, Here's like our coffee thing. Uh-huh, uh-huh. These are the chairs that Lauren brought and this is the table that we're actually matches the floor really well. I know. Yeah, yeah. It's so cute. So quick little update. This is what the couch looks like. We put our throw pillows on. Both of the covers and the inserts are from Ikea. I'm obsessed with them. They were really cheap, so I like that too. And then this little tassel -y throw blanket is from Target. It's from that Opal House collection, which I love. I'm obsessed yes. with Lauren's headboard. So obsessed. And I love this. It matches this. I'm so excited to see this. Oh yes, we stand. Take a moment. put my box spring and mattress on and put my mattress cover on and that's like my duvet and stuff but put my nightstand in the corner and here's my dresser and three boxes that I have to set up but I put my desk in the corner and I'm gonna put the hutch on top as soon as the windex dries and it's just gonna look so nice over in that corner and then the dresser there <laughs> I just finished bed. As we can clearly tell by my face, I am dripping in sweat because it's very hot in here. Target shipped me just one of those shams and it said it came in a pack of two, so I'm gonna have to contact them about that. So just picture the two white ruffly shams there. And then I also don't have my bedroom pillows that I'm bringing from home, so I'm gonna do um, my two sheet shams behind there. There's no headboard to support them, but this is kind of like my all white look with the pop of blue. That's gonna go up on my dresser once that's set up on Saturday. But the next thing I'm gonna do, I think, is gonna put my desk catch up here and unpack any desk stuff that I brought, which I think is pretty minimal actually, but yeah. So I just finished putting my hutch on top of my desk and I just went next it a little bit, cleaned it off. So I'm gonna drape over my gray throw blanket from my dorm last year just so that it kind of breaks up all the white and it kind of ties in with the gray, but it's still neutral and I think it'll look super cute. I'll probably put also, I have this gold pillow from home and probably put that there, maybe a blue pillow. I also set up this cubicle. This is from last year's dorm. This is as part of my nightstand. So my next and probably final thing I'm going to be doing today is just quickly setting up my bathroom with two towers. I'm gonna have to set up this one from Target, hang my shower curtain, put this little thing in the bottom of my tub, and then I also have to unpack this little laundry bin. <laughs> I just finished my bathroom, which I think looks just so bright, so nice. I also have this cart here. So, we made it through. We did. We survived. It was a long day. It was the <laughs> longest day. It is currently 4.31. You were up at six? Yep. Yep. I was out of at six, but Got felt like it. it. We love it. We survived. 
now on to Saturday. It's gonna be so pretty. Oh, I'm, I'm so, so excited. excited. <laughs> Just keep watching. Good morning, everyone. Today is Saturday, so it's a few days later, and today is day two of moving. I am so excited because I'm officially going back to school today. I'm so excited to see my friends tonight and all that. So I just wanna show you guys real quick what the back of our cars look like just because they're all packed up and they look so nice. This is the back of my car. This is the coffee table that I spent hours and hours and hours painting. Some of the stuff that fits underneath it. We just have a bunch of stuff. I have my two things of hanging clothes. I've got my pin board, I guess, and a bunch of other stuff. I got some stuff in the middle. So we were supposed to leave at nine this morning just so that we'd have ample time to unpack and stuff. But I actually have to pick up my computer this morning from the Apple store because it was being repaired and it wasn't ready even though they said it would be yesterday so I have to go get that and they open at 10 so I'm gonna swing over there in the next few minutes but we are about to leave I'm so excited that you like crack the ice cubes into it's like a big bin updates in the living room. I have this cubicle from home, which I used last year in my dorm. And then I have the coffee table that I slaved over, um, some art and the plant. And then we have more plants over here. I'm thinking of maybe hanging that up. So I have finished setting up the bathroom. I have some extra products there. A lot of my main products are up here, just hair ties. It's all my hair stuff, it's all my skin stuff. This is kind of just extras. Um, and I use this little shelf liner from Ikea. I really like it. In here I just have tampons, stuff like that. I have some random stuff down here, just like whitening strips, Fiori strips, face masks, sunscreen. And here's all my travel bags. We actually had to do a second shower curtain back here to make sure that it's all covered. And I think we actually might have to do a third, which is kind of ridiculous. But it's just these liner things. You can barely see them. This is what that part looks like. I just have all my shower products here. Whoa. I thought it was freaking. Whoa. The celebratory last drawer pulls. We are four and a half hours in. <laughs> Best dresser I've ever seen. Are you afraid of me or the dresser? Oh, that was the biggest dad joke I've ever heard. That was definitely a dad joke. Oh yeah. We have a headboard. But just some final updates. We hung up these pin boards. We got my headboard on. I put my shoes in the corner back here and literally don't even fill out the shoe rack. Like what? Who am I? I've yet to put my clothes in my dresser, but I'm gonna do that. And then I've finished putting all my stuff in my desk and I think it looks cute, but I think I'm gonna rearrange, especially up here. I don't love that. I just kind of have my clothes left to do, which I don't think will take me very long. And just kind of decorating and stuff. Just getting this off the bed. But I think I'm going to actually end this video here just so that, one, I don't have to keep recording because that's been really stressful all day. But two, I also wanted to wait to show you guys the room in its entirety once it's finally finished, once it's perfect, which will probably be in a few weeks from now when I do a room tour. I'm so excited for that. But if you made it to the end of this video, thank you so much for watching. If you're new, subscribe down below. And I'll see you all in my next video. Bye, guys.